Hey fellows, welcome back. Um, <laughs> I have two things to talk about today. Um, well, you know that I've been trying to modify the uh, remote controller of my MJX B3. So we, we ended up with this one, uh, attaching a 5 dB Wi-Fi router antenna, which uh, is supposed to operate at 2.4 GHz, which is the range that the original remote controller is using. Uh, originally, I've left both antennas inside the original in the RC, as well as this 5 dB antenna. However, after recommending or after getting recommendations from some people, I uh, decided to eventually leave only the 5 dB antenna. And now we'll find out what's the range. Uh, I've chosen an area which has um, signal disturbance almost close to zero. You can see uh, it's, it's a wide open area, almost nothing here, no Wi-Fi networks, no other kind of transmissions whatsoever. And I'm really looking forward to how this thing is going to behave. Originally I was having difficulties to go beyond 200 meters, so I'm, I'm really hoping that this modification is going to give me a slightly better range. So stay here and let's find out. And one more spoiler, I've been working on this since a while. You can see this is a self-made box uh, where I actually house my MJX. Um, it's done out of polycarbonate and some foam and a lot of duct tape as you can see. Um, and it's, it does a pretty decent job. I mean it's very comfortable to carry the drone and very soon you can expect a video uh, to find out how exactly I've constructed this uh, some measurements I I decided to do it extra big so uh, follow the channel and this video is eventually going to appear there now time for flying let's take out the original battery okay and show time okay Okay, slight angle correction, all right, that should be good enough. Good. Yeah, there are some sticks here, let's try it again. Perfect. <laughs> All right, everybody. Well, I, I just found where my drone is. Uh, that has been a long, long way to go, and well, 
it broken. I decided to land it because you can see this is where I started my journey from. I don't know how far it is now, I'm going to check on Google Maps. Uh, everything was good until I kind of lost visual because when the drone is that far away you can't really see where it moves and I tried to land it and it unfortunately broke at the same place where it used to be broken before. Hey everybody! Yeah, that's, that's the kind of the end of today's session, uh, which I'm apparently ending with kind of mixed feelings. According to Google Maps, I have reached, even went slightly beyond the distance of 500 meters, and luckily my remote computer didn't say that the range is over. I tried to land the drone, but because it was very bad visibility, in 500 meters you barely see anything, uh, it was probably a bumpy landing, and unfortunately, you can see the, the shoulder broke again at the very same place where uh, it broke last time. So, I'm gonna have to repair it. The new body is on its way, it's uh, a black one in color, and I'm looking forward to this one. On the other side, this case looks lovely. I mean, um, does exactly what it is supposed to do. And you can check one of my next videos and find out uh, how exactly this goes. So, that's about it for now. Apparently I'm going to <laughs> suspend for a while making videos, uh, or FPV videos, and I have to start thinking about purchasing an FPV system so that I can see what's going on when the drone really gets far away from me. Thanks for watching, see you around, cheers!